Hey guys, so today I have swatches of the Colors de Carol Valentine's Day Trio. There are three polishes, obviously, it's a trio. Two hollows and a crelly. Um, these are really, really fun and I'm really excited about these because they're beautiful. So I will get into the swatches. So the first polish is called Velvet Kisses and this is a dark pink hollow. So here is one coat of Velvet Kisses. So this one covers really well on one coat. It's not quite a one coater because I can see just a tiny bit of my nail line still, but that is because I'm really picky. I think if you weren't as horribly picky as I am, then you could easily get away with one coat of this. It's very, very smooth. It's very, very easy to apply. So there is one coat of Velvet Kisses. I can still see a tiny bit of my nail line, so I'm going to let that dry and come back for a second coat. So here is two coats of Velvet Kisses. So you can see that the color deepens up quite a bit and it covers the nail line completely on two coats. This has a nice strong hollow on it too. I wore this one to work today and I actually work inside with fluorescent lights and I could still see the hollow really, really well. So there is two coats of Velvet Kisses. The next polish is called In Love and this is a lighter pink hollow. So here is one coat of In Love. This one is also really nicely opaque on the first coat. Not 100%, I can see a little bit of my nail line, but it's still really nice. And the formula on this one is just like the other one, really, really smooth, really easy to apply. It might be a little bit on the thick side, this and the other one too, but not so much that it makes it hard to apply. So there is one coat of In Love. I'm gonna let that dry and come back for a second coat. So here is two coats of In Love. You can see this one gets a tiny bit darker on two coats and it also covers completely. This one also has a nice strong hollow like the other one does. I don't know why but I've been like really really loving pink hollows lately so I was really excited to find these in my mailbox. So there is two coats of In Love. So the next polish is called Cuddles and this is a light 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 almost white, milky pink curly base with red squares, pink hexes, white hexes, gold circles, and a very fine pink glitter that runs throughout it. So here is one coat of Cuddles. So this one is a tiny bit thin. It wants to run just a little bit. Because there's no really chunky glitter in here, it makes it really easy to get the glitter out. I haven't had this sitting upside down or anything, and I've gotten just about every glitter shape that's in there out already. So there is one coat of Cuddles. I'm going to let that dry and come back for a second coat. So here is two coats of Cuddles. This covered pretty well on two coats on my pointer finger, but I'm not sure if it's going to be like that throughout all of them. Again, I'm getting a ton of glitter on my brush just by dipping in. I'm not having to fish or swirl at all. So there is two coats of Cuddles. My middle finger is a little weird. My camera battery died right as I put the polish on my nail and I thought I could get my other battery in in time to spread it out and I couldn't. So it went on really thick around the middle and I couldn't spread it around. So just ignore that finger. But this did cover completely in two coats. It did take a little bit of manipulation to get the glitter in the right spots on the nail, but not very much. And that is the Colors to Carol Valentine's Day trio for this year. Again, I will link Colors to Carol down below so you guys can check these out. I hope you enjoyed this, and I will talk to you later.